Donald Trump continues to have outstanding loans in the tens of millions or even hundreds of millions of dollars with respect to the very same properties that are at issue in this New York civil fraud trial. Does this, I think we have a, a little graphic of the number of creditors that Trump's had, which may be illegible, but gives you a sense of the numbers. A lot of creditors, right? Yep. Is it an arms race here? Like if, if Tish James starts calling in the debts, does that then uh, scare other creditors potentially who are like, oh, maybe he's not going to be solvent for that much longer. I mean, could that be a domino effect? Well, not only that, but if she obtains a judgment lien, which is basically a legal piece of paper that allows her to start seizing property and effectively prevent him from selling things, that in and of itself might be an event of default mm. under some of his outstanding loans, which will allow a perspective, you know, a particular lender to go out and keep the collateral.